What's up guys? Today we are watching John Wick Chapter 4. So, last movie, you know, we left John teaming up with the other dude that I thought was dead. And, you know, he still has the whole world coming after him. So, you know, it's still a whole big debacle and I'm still surprised that the man is still alive. But at this point, he just seemed invin like invincible. So, like, I'm not even going to question it. But, like... Wait, who was the dude that shot him last movie? Winston. We have to see what's up with Winston because he seemed to switch sides, but I don't know. I think someone in my comments said that, like, maybe they did that on purpose to help him get away. I don't know. Hopefully that's the case because I liked Winston, but we're just going to have to see ourselves. So I'm ready to get into this movie, so let's just get into it. That last forever as do I abandon all Is he walking John Wick's dog? You are now in the presence of the motherfucking king. <laughs> Who are you talking to, bro? It's just you and him and the dog. Yeah. When is that man not gonna be ready? Are we already hopping into this man doing shit on a horse? This man is in the desert, on a horse, shooting at people. And that didn't take him long, but I'm assuming he might be going after that dude that was just on the cliff up there. My ring. My freedom. Is he gonna grant you that though? And the only way John Wick will ever have freedom or peace now or ever is in death. I was just thinking that too. I'm like, probably the only way out is death, but I feel like he's somehow gonna figure a way out. Yeah. Not really. Okay, I was gonna- I was about to say, like, the way he says yeah, like, he already said that shit twice in the same way. So we're gonna see how many times he does that. <laughs> hmm. Didn't that dude just pass away? Like a few months ago. By order of the Marquis, Vincent Bassett de Gramont, this hotel has been condemned. Did he just take it from you then? And you're gonna pull out an hourglass? Okay. Giving the Marquis the power of Autem Imperator, which means he is now our judge jury and executioner or not i thought that's how it was going to end so you have the unshakable faith of david my friend but you shouldn't be here this will not be pleasant when has anything been pleasant like in this whole thing say how you do anything is how you do everything. Call it the first and the last rule of life. Bill Skarsgård? I... I feel like I seen him on the poster and I totally forgot he was in this movie. I shot him. 
<laughs> he lives. Polluting everything he touches. See, I was about to say, how do you know that he lived, but they didn't find a body, which is why. He is simply the face of your failure, Mr. Manager. I don't think so, because at this point, if he was a failure, he'd be dead. And he's not. Did he just bomb a place? You no longer need the services of a concierge. No. So he dies this early in the movie? Are you kidding me? I didn't think he was gonna die at all. I'd want to kill that man. Forget you, Bill Skarsgård. I don't know your character's name. I don't care. I'm pissed. I meant what came. I'm guessing that's the Kane dude. I have a name for you. Respectfully. I'm retired. Finished. Done. So was John Wick. So now you're not. I know the deal I made. He already knows. Just going backwards. We give you a name, you give us a life. Oh, we take one. So he's gonna have to go after his friend anyway. Emotional support animal. She's your support animal. Other way around, I'm hers. Is it that bad? If you still say no to that dog. It's not too bad. Not bad at all. You've been drawing this man? The ship with Mr. Wick is no secret. The table will come. And we'll be met with our grace. So are you gonna turn on him or what? Next thing you know, they're both going to be dead at the door. So they won't be at the door because he's already there and didn't have to kill no one. Winston? Alive, but they executed his concierge to prove a point. He was cool with them, too. The table will never stop. You know this. So, does that mean you have to kill everyone on the table to be done with this? Soon, Friendship means little when it's convenient. So I'm guessing he's not turning on him, so we're good. Please, make yourself comfortable. He ain't getting no freaking manager. Oh shit. And kill them all. I believe he'll try. But no one 
Not even you can kill everyone. You sure about that? He seemed to be getting by so far. Mr. Wick is our guest. Father. I'll talk to them. They don't know you're here. Okay. Stay with Mr. Wick. He's gonna end up dying. I have a feeling. People has reason to believe that this facility is providing services ut qui excommunicantu. He's on the roof, but you don't know that until he's probably going to come down and fight all of you. Maybe. We speak for the Marquis. And I speak for Osaka. Your guns, please. They ain't going to give up shit. Hello, old friend. I didn't think he was gonna show up. Do you know, we don't have to end this with blood. So you're gonna have a civil conversation as friends and then break out in a fight? Brotherhood. Enough! By order of the Marquise de Gramont, this hotel has been deconsecrated. Step aside. Why is it always a hotel? Because this is the second one. Don't do this, Koji. Oh, shit. <laughs> that man just took it in the arm. Like it didn't hurt. So while all of this is happening, what's going on upstairs with our dude John and the daughter? And they got more. So they might make you get out. Secure the hotel. Fine wick. I'm surprised our bestie John has not came out here and started helping. Maybe he's saving his energy, but I don't know. She was prepared. Okay. You're telling me this man hasn't got shot once? I feel like they're, they've been so close range that he would have gotten shot at least once by now. That man, his leg was just stuck to the wall and he fell. Uh. Middle. Mm -hmm. Man's just eaten while this all goes down. Hey, blind man, do your job. <laughs> he was fueling up first. He he's just like Daredevil. He's blind, but he can fight. But he doesn't have powers. That is smart. Okay. I didn't know that's what it was. I was like, 
but they're doorbells that have sensors. What is that dude even blocking with? Cause he keeps like pulling up his jacket. Like what is that? Eww. All the way up his body, bro. And he's still going. I would have been down by the first one, man. Now she gets shot. You kidding me, bro? After all of that? And I thought the dad was gonna die, but no, it might be her. And John, do me a small courtesy. Take it again, I'll cross that degree. Yes. It's nice that he's respecting what he wants. Cause I mean, he did offer to stay to help, but he's like, nah. He even reloaded with you right there, bro. What can't that man use? He can use a gun, a sword, he'll come at you with nunchucks. My god. He has a gun and he's choosing to use the nunchucks, man. That's how you know. He can do anything and y'all suck. How many men is this man gonna fight in this scene? Now it's going to be them two. They gave you my name. They're giving everyone your name, bro. What do you mean? Why are you surprised? I'm sorry. Me too. He didn't want to, but he has to, you know. You should have stayed out. For all our sakes. I tried. It didn't work out for him, man. It's so weird, it's like two best of the best are fighting, so it's gonna take a while. You took a deal. Same as you, John. Family. Always, you know, what else are they gonna use against you? You dead, John? It is so weird because he has a clear shot right now and he's just like, I ain't gonna say nothing, I ain't gonna shoot him. John. Jane. Oh, that other dude. I was about to be like, who the hell is this? But it's like, already a new dude. John Wick, open pay up, 20 yen, 
What was he at before? Was it like 13 or something? Or 15? We have barely gotten any chill scene in like 10-15 minutes. It's been constant action. What are those symbols? Oh, so dude's helping him. Okay. Wait. No. Or not. Not enough. But it's getting there. So he's just gonna like help you for now until it increases? Emotional support dog. Kicking some ass. Leave. Go somewhere far away. So they both gonna end up dying? Because I feel like she's going to end up bleeding out. <laughs> so they both hurt. Because she just said, you've been shot. You're both going to die. How? You were just on the ground doing that shit. And you got cut even more. Oh, yeah. And yeah. Yep, now he's gonna be fully dead and can't even up his daughter. I'll be waiting for you. So what, are they both gonna like team up? Cause she's probably gonna hate John for coming anyway. Cause if he didn't come, her dad wouldn't be dead. Empty subcar? No way. Someone's gonna come out from under the seat and try and attack you. What possibility could there have been that they get on the same subway train at the same time? Like, how does she get there as fast? But now she's gonna try and kill him? I understand. Okay, so she still wants him to kill the other dude. I thought she was about to be hella pissed and try and kill that man, but she would just end up dead like her dad and he wouldn't really want to do that. Mr. Wick. I thought she was gonna stay with you for the movie, not gonna be on, like, not gonna lie. I thought y'all might team up. Thanks for coming. Well, us homeless folk do have to stick together now, don't we? So they're gonna team up again? Does John know? Last time you spoke to him, you shot him off a roof. I had no choice. You're a turn for So what are you? Agreed. You 
you make it your choice. So that dude is over there and he had the chance to kill John Wick but didn't because it wasn't enough money and how are they going to like deal with that unless they just won't find out. Now are you able to locate him? Pain, I'll tell you. Okay, I, I kind of want to know too. How much? Would such a service be worth? 25 million, plus a matching contribution to my 401k when he's dead. Mm. So you just need a five more million for that shit to be enough. Well, this that is. Mm -hmm. And I just realized dude also has a pin like the one that john took so maybe they're table members so he already killed one and the other a man committed to the cause which one are you <laughs> he didn't look that intimidating until now Is that for their friend that died? The Marquis de Gramont, elevated only by his guarantee of killing you. All the resources at the table are at his disposal. Oh, so that's what it means. So it's not like exactly the table. Huh? With him dead. Oh, and then? Hmm? We haven't gotten that far. Kill him, but do it the smart way. And get him to give you your freedom. How's that possible, though? Turn his rules and consequences against him. Challenge him to single combat. High table duels are a myth. So they're not a myth. Okay. Get them to issue the challenge and then offer you up as proxy. Well, I don't have a family. The Ruska Roma tore my ticket. Don't offer up the dog. Oh, I thought he was about to say, offer up the dog since you don't have family. But I guess maybe that would be stupid to say. I don't know. You get out of this, Winston. What you are so good at getting, Jonathan? Revenge. Okay. So Winston is still a little bit on our side. And I just want to know how this is going to turn out. Start in, mate. Okay. I didn't expect her to care about a gun. Oh, shit. My name is no Pagavari. It's a diary Petrov. I did not think man was going to try and shoot you. Because I was just about to say, don't burn down another church. But you might have to because of him. Asshole. I was just about to say, if John kills the other dude, does that mean he's going to take his dog and then his dog will have a friend? But that's not an appropriate thing right now. He is about to get hung. He might be old, but he's still in good ass shape, so you can't tell him shit. Put a bullet in the elder's head. The Marquis had one put in Piotr's. And in fine Russia. Oh shit, okay. In the help of 
each other. You can't even help yourself. How the hell are you going to help us? What if he actually can and he's just like letting you keep him like that? It's Yvonne Niminyayet. It does if I kill him in a duel. So that catches our attention. And the crest. Harkan first, then we talk. Bring proof of death. So now he has to kill someone else for her to help him. I am Klaus. I don't like how you said your own name. Not me. Him. John? How are you? Of course this dude is gonna show up out of nowhere. What the hell? They gave you up. It's a vain hope of saving themselves. You see, that's why I never trust the Cossacks. I, uh, dirty beep. I really can't believe that they gave him up. Allow me to help. Nine? We have a deal. I was about to say, it is fucking hilarious. As soon as he gets a gun on John, he's like, no, I gotta do it. We have him in the So that dude's there too, okay. I thought we'd play a game. One hand. The winner decides who lives and who does not. No thanks, bro. Just get it over with. Well, I don't gamble. Let's see. I was just about to say, how how do you tell what you have? Four nines and a four. How do you know? And one thinks he can kill his way out. I believe he can too. Let me guess, five of kind? Yeah. That's the four times that I mean I said yeah like that. Did I miss any earlier? No, maybe a little bit. Did he just kill that man with a or I mean like cut him with a card? It seems like he's on the set for a freaking YouTube video. They clearly see that he's shooting people and they're just like, I'm gonna continue to dance. I didn't expect him to know how to fight that good. Okay. That had to have broken your back, bro. If you are, if you get up, I, are you supernatural at this point, you know? And how is your back not broken? <laughs> it 
it's just the way people are so oblivious about it because you see them looking at them and you know getting killed with an axe and shit and then they're just like I'm gonna keep going you know and it's blowing my mind God damn. You know, every time I look at this dude, he reminds me of the character from Nightmare Before Christmas. I forgot the character's name, but I don't know. Can't lie though, that dude did put up a good fight. How? Forget you and your inhaler. Die already. Instead of shooting you in the ass, he hit you in the ass with an axe. Why don't you just die? Why don't you? Didn't they give you up though? Via Jeezy, Maya Jeezy. You gotta brand yourself for this shit? For the old ways and the old laws, John Wick calls you to a duel. To settle your differences the old-fashioned way, as gentlemen should. As he should. And you're gonna die. A man of Mr. Wick's station cannot issue such a challenge. He has his family's crest. He got what he needed, bitch. So don't be too scared to take the challenge. You could be remembered as the man who brought John Wick, the most feared of all by the table of all who sit at it, into the light. He's boosting his ego even though he knows he ain't gonna win. What's that? A man second, like his sponsor. Either walks out with his champion, or is buried beside him. Are you about to kill Winston? Oh, I thought he was about to die. I was like, the fuck? Is this what they meant by duel? Because whenever they say duel, I thought of like, you know, the sword fight, but that is also like back then, so that's my bad. Sacre coeur. Weapons. If you win, the table will honor its word. Oh wait, so they're picking how the duel, like how and what the duel is going to be. Because this is who you are. Who you've always been. You are a killer. I don't think I see had to be. I mean, if you think about it, he was retired until someone killed his dog. And look at the situation we're in now. Jane. So be it. Sunrise, Sacre Coeur. He's nominating Kane to do it for him. There's only John Wick, the killer. And he's going to kill you. I was literally about to say, and he's going to kill you next, bro. So call him a killer all you want. He does it because he has to. Won't do it. You fight your own fight. Isn't this what you want? No. 
You wanted him to kill John. So he's scared. So he's nominating Kane to do it for him. That's a coward. Can I just say, man has not seen his dog all movie. I'm just saying. Like, I saw the dog at the beginning of the movie. He didn't even see, so... After my daughter was born, I want to leave this life. I thought I did. Something brought y'all back in. I miss you, John. It's so good to sit with a friend. I feel like if, if he does end up you know, killing his friend, which I'm pretty sure he will. He might end up helping or taking care of his daughter. I don't know. Of course, they're going to play this kind of music for John. Bonjour, Monsieur Wick, and welcome to La Resistance. Finally, I feel like he's barely been in the movie. And if you're here, where's the dog? Well, he has all three. Besides, I have a feeling Mr. Wick will never make it to the duel by sunrise. I think it will because I mean, if you think about it, they already fought each other and they're both still alive. Why are they upping the cost if he's going through a duel? They know they gotta upgrade their bullets because of the suits that he wears. And so it begins. I'm going to need a gun. I thought you'd never ask. Should have been giving him guns. How close can you get me to the church? So what exactly is he doing right now? I thought he was waiting for the duel, unless duel starts at sunrise or something, I don't know. Jonathan, wait, sir. Sunrise is at 6.03. Don't be late for all our sakes, hmm? So something starts at sunrise. So is it the duel actually, or that's just when it's like this thing is over? Hmm? That's what I want on mine. John. Loving husband. Let's just walk and fight in the middle of traffic. He's still not even hurt a little bit. See, it reminds me of the freaking thing earlier. Man's just gonna keep getting hit with cars. I just realized man only has one gun. And how many things does he have to reload? It's so weird, we have seen more of this dog than John's dog. Go! 
You got your ragged by a dog. But you know what scares me? Everyone is also dealing with guns, so it's like, what if they shoot that dog? He just used the gun that you plan to use on him. That's sad. I thought it was bound to happen that they'd fall through a hole at some point because I saw like two of them so far. Period. Not another dog is dying. Now you better be thankful that man saved your dog. And he's still gonna be okay. You know, that's nothing. Bonne chance. Someone's gonna be at the top of them steps. You didn't even get up the first flight. He made it up all them stairs just to get pushed down. And he keeps tumbling. And he's fine, you know? Again. How does this man not have anything broken? He has had to fall down at least 10 more flights of stairs. And he's gonna be fine. Just a little sore, you know? John? Kane? What time is sunrise? 6.15. Oh. Oh. I need you to get to the top of those stairs, John. Look at him encouraging yeah. you. That's number five. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. How many times are you gonna say yeah, bro? Twelve or nine. Nine! It is so weird that now that dude is basically on his side. <laughs> the way that man just sits down and does his shit, like... That's right, remember he saved him, so you better be on his side now. As you should. Unless you just killed him so you could be the one to kill him. I can hate you, motherfucker. Let's go, John. <laughs> Puppy. He killed someone for his dog too. 
and the dog's peeing on him. Okay. But again, now you see, people do shit for their animals. See, I was about to say, it looks kind of too dark to be 615, but... And so we begin. Oh yeah, they're dueling, because dude's a coward and wouldn't do it himself. Positions, gentlemen. This never seemed like it would be a thing that would happen in a John Wick movie, but we're gonna go with it. What a beautiful sunrise. I just got a fin I got a feeling that Winston is about to die. I don't know why. Oh, animus vestris, sibimus ut finum, sine sinerum, pulvis ut pulvis. I say they both just shoot. So, where did he hit the other dude? They both shot each other in the arm. Fire! So he got hit in the shoulder, other dude got hit. Okay. Just kill him. I was about to say, this is getting to the point where it's like past uh, like realistic shit, but it's been way past that. Did he miss a shot with dude? No weapon. Give it to me. Is my daughter free now? Wait, you and your daughter. So after man's hurt, that's when you want to do that shit. Okay, that proves how much of a bitch you are. You arrogant asshole. He didn't shoot. Consequences. Yeah. That's why I was questioning, so did he not shoot the other dude? So, okay, yeah, he had his bullet saved, and bam. So is the other dude not gonna die? Cause they, they both got shot, and they're both hurt, but like. Your obligation to the table is satisfied, John Wick. You are free. He's a free man. You owe me one. Yeah. Now you're taking his signature line. Winston. Jonathan. Will you take me home? Take him back to his dog and let him live his life as a furry man for once. You need some medical attention, bro. Or do you, do you just need a breather for a second?
It's her. Don't you dare be how this ends. Okay, okay. You're kidding me, bro. The dog, uh, you. Uh, I want to quit. Who knows? Poor dog. But I mean, he has a good owner still. And he got loving husband on his tombstone like he wanted. That's it? You know, I was... I was so confused because I'm not gonna lie to you I I saw that what's it called I saw that there could be like a possibility of a John Wick 5 and I'm just like so man survived again in this movie what the fuck are the other people talking about how how is John Wick 5 a possibility man's dead I did not think that they were actually going to kill him this movie. I I went into this with such a different expectation. <laughs> they actually killed his dog. I mean, not his dog. I mean, they killed him. And he didn't even get to see his dog. The dog was in the beginning with the dude. And then he was fighting, like, boxing the thing. Next time we see the dog, it's with the dude, but at John Wick's tombstone. He didn't see his dog the whole movie. But you're kidding me. How? How is he after all that shit? What was the point of him getting his freedom if he was just going to die? I'm pissed. I was expecting maybe there was going to be a John Wick 5 and I was going to be like, you know what? I'm going to watch it anyway, even though it's going to be unrealistic as fuck again. But you know what? I was going to do that for Keanu Reeves. But now I don't have to. He's dead. It's like, what do you, what was, where do I even start? Well, I already started talking about this shit, but it's like, he went through so much shit. So much pain, should have broke his back so many fucking times for him to die by gunshots. His friend was okay. He should have been okay. At least he's with his, like, at least he's with his wife. But it still pisses me off. Like, I felt like that was, that happened for no reason. He fought for his freedom for nothing. He's a, he became a free man. I was like, what are you gonna do? Now they're free. What does he do? He dies. I'm not gonna be able to get over that. Cause that's bullshit. That's pointless. He could have went out a totally different way. And I just, he barely spoke this entire fucking movie. I think I saw somewhere that someone counted how many times he talked in this movie and it said like 300 and something. And it's like, I feel like it's even less than that. There was nonstop action after like in this movie. And it's like, you barely had any time to like be peaceful. But then, like, you do for, like, a few seconds, and then, bam, something else. Like, fight scene after fight scene for man to die. I can't believe that. I, if anything, I thought, 
Winston was gonna die. I thought maybe other dude was gonna die too somehow. But you know what? He didn't. It was John Wick. It's pissing me off. I feel like, mmm, they could have just ended with the third one and just let him go off and fight. And you know what? Maybe, actually, no, they probably should have just ended it here. But I just feel like there was, there should have been a totally different way he could have went out. Make it better. Like, it really just got my hopes up that there could be another movie. And then now there's not because, again, he's gone. At least he's with his wife and his dog and his friend that died at the beginning of the movie. Who also died in real life. But, you know. I swear, the amount of death that happened in this movie. And then the one, like, there were two major ones this movie the last one being the most major one because it was the main character who ki well i can't say who kills the main character there are a lot of movies that kill main characters but i don't think they kill like the main main character in a lot of movies or actually no there's a lot of movies i can name right now but it's also like i don't know but still, I don't even know what to think. I really just didn't expect him to die this movie. And he said, out of those 300 and something words that he said throughout this whole movie, he said, yeah, seven times. Because I counted that shit, unless there were times I kind of missed. I think there were seven. But, like, you would think they would want to give him a little bit more dialogue because, you know, yeah, this is an action movie, but we need a little break every now and then and, like, longer scenes. But that's not what happened in this movie. Oh, well. It's like, in the first movie, we had a lot of, like, like chill scenes. Like, you could go between fight scene and then a chill scene like it evened itself out but then in like as you keep going through the movies it's like you get less chill scenes more action and it's like overwhelming a bit but you know what we're sticking with it for Keanu Reeves not anymore since there's not gonna be another one but still forget this movie out of all of them do I want to say this is my least favorite one I'm gonna say this is my least favorite one because the two people that died, besides Bill Skarsgård, he, he was a different character in this one and I didn't really care for his character, so. But yeah, I'm just gonna say this one is my least favorite one. Which one's gonna be my favorite? Okay, so fourth place, chapter four third place we're gonna go I want to say the second one and then the second place is gonna be the third one and then first place will be the first one and you know what I don't know if I should do that because that one is when the doggy dies but we might just keep it anyway but then I thought that the second movie was better than the first one so then should i flip i don't know am i gonna change my feelings about this shit i'm gonna just keep it the way it is fourth one second one third one first one that's how i'm liking these movies ain't gonna be a fifth one so forget that but yeah i guess i enjoyed this movie a little bit it was constant like constant action and sometimes I did kind of get bored a little bit but overall it wasn't that bad of a movie but yeah I still did enjoy it I don't even know what else to say about this shit so I guess 
check out the rest of my channel for other movies that I've reacted to. 